Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back to Little Big Planet. Today we are moving on with a new sector of the story mode. It is the Canyons by Uncle Jalapeno. Some of the most difficult levels in the game are in this section, so I think we're gonna have a hard time, but it'll also be a fun time as we move into Boomtown by once again, Uncle Jalapeno. And let's take a look at the description. Rescue Uncle Jalapeno from the evil sheriff Zapata. <laughs> All right, well, we'll give it a shot, see what ends up happening with it. We have 80 items to collect, and that is quite a lot. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Of course, in this episode, we'll be playing through the entire first three levels, and then next episode, we'll be going through them again, 100% completing each one of them. So hopefully everything turns out just fine. But for right now, we have fun. It looks like uh, they're, they're still enjoying their wedding, which is nice. Give my best to Uncle Jalapeno. Oh, and tell him to be careful of exp those explosives of his. Okay. So let us get over this way. And I do have to be careful. I still want to try to collect as much as we can. But I don't know how to get up here. Um, hmm. I feel like I should just be able to jump forward, but I, I can't. Can't jump in that way. Okay. Hmm. Oh wait, oh, there we go, they're leaving. See ya. Wait, no, wait, 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 wait. Oh, come on, there goes my ace. Get out of here. <laughs> I need you to leave. Okay, so maybe if I just do that, they'll just leave for good? Yeah, there we go, that's better. Okay, so. I'm gonna, well this isn't turning off very well at all. <laughs> what the heck, how do I get over there? You can see that there's like something behind the cactus to the left, but I don't know, this is weird. Maybe if I run this way, we'll check out these costumes now and then I can get a checkpoint and move backwards. I have no clue, but it looks like we got some guy with a poncho and then we have some lady with some other stuff as well. What is, I've noticed that it does give us some stuff that the, like the game itself didn't give us, like it gave us some, or at least like, okay. It gave us some stuff, ooh, that looks cool that it doesn't show in the pictures back here. Let's reset this. No, not randomize, reset, there we go. And we got these two, we got the really cool pinata one. I like that a lot. Then we also got the Mexican wrestler. Both are awesome. We can put the rainbow one for now. And then I think it was just normal eyes. I wanna do the, the, the costumes that are in the background. Let's just focus on those for now. We got ourselves the sombrero. And then I think, yeah, this mustache, which is the long mustache. Moving over this way. I don't know, he doesn't have any pants. All he has is a poncho, I think it's called. Right over this way. Uh, red poncho, yeah, so that's it. <laughs> I mean, while it does look cool with the pinata, I think the base costume is supposed to be this. So this is one of the, I, I, I usually consider these in the background to be the official costume, unless they seem like there's something wrong with them. Like, you know, like what we had last with the wedding where the, the zombie girl was on the zombie boy and like vice versa. Okay, so let's reset again and we'll set up that other ladies. So I think she just has the normal sack boy skin. But going up this way, she had the senorita wig. <laughs> so I guess this is the senorita costume. She did not have a mustache, good to keep in mind. And then she had, pretty simple, I think she had the senorita, is this it? Lace trim dress. That looks about right. Interesting for her it was red, but I think that can be changed if we go to these. Like if ours. There you go, see? That's what really changes those. Okay, that seems about right. Okay, cool, so we'll go ahead and save that one as well. I do wanna change the costume back to being the blue. I just like this a lot. I mean, usually sometimes I'll go with uh, the green, but I like the blue for right now. Anyways, we'll move back to being zebra, but I wanted to check those two out real fast. They were very cool. And let's try to figure this way. Wait, 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 let me go try to get a checkpoint from over this way, if we can find one. Oh, hello. Hola, the evil Sheriff Zapata has kidnapped Uncle Jalapeno. Please help him. I'll do what I can. So let's grab this checkpoint. And I mean, I'm, I'm so terrified that the ace has already been ruined. I do see some stuff behind this cactus. I just, I feel like it's gonna be a tough episode. Even though we're not really sweating too much collecting of everything, it's still gonna be really tough. So hopefully we can learn as much as we can as we try to explore and survive it all. But now that I've done all that, hopefully I can just find a way around and up. I mean, I know I can get up like this. And then I can just jump across, yeah, there we go. And then there should be, I swear I saw something back here. Huh, maybe there isn't. Well, what do you know? <laughs> That's odd, because I swear I saw something up there. But regardless, we can still at least hop up and get that little material, whatever that is. There we go. Hey, there's something going on with this as well. I don't know if, there, maybe there's a, a trigger somewhere around here? Not with this, but okay. Let us just try to get back up here one more time. And super jump, uh, I'm gonna have to get that next time we try this level, because I don't think we can get up there for right now. That's fine, you know, I'm not supposed to, you know, collect everything right now, but if I can, that makes it easier. 
Oh, I remember these platforms. They're a little wobbly, which is not easy to go around. And of course the cactuses, the cacti are very spiked. We got some new wooden, no, that's not wood. I think that's supposed to be rock material. Pretty cool. I love this area though. Like the aesthetic to this place is really, really cool. I think it has some of the most memorable levels in the game. I just think they're also really tough, especially later on. I think the last level to this area can be really challenging. Let's go ahead and push this a little bit. Just all the vibrant colors and stuff is really, really fun. Okay, ready, set, whoop, there we go. So I did wanna talk about something that I haven't, oh wait, you know what, let's worry about this first. As you can see, there are some explosives. We press the button and boom, they all go exploding. This area can be a bit tough because we got these flaming little rocks. I think we have to hide under the little divots before the rocks come and get us. Or we can just you know, go down like this. But yeah, I did wanna talk about one thing. Some of you may not know, but Media Molecule, the people who created Little Big Planet, are actually working on a new game that is not a new Little Big Planet game, but it feels like the successor to a Little Big Planet game. Oh gosh, I think another rock's coming. No, no, okay, we're fine. It is basically it's basically like Little Big Planet, but more. It's called Dreams, and it looks like a lot of fun. And I'll be playing it. Apparently, the rumor. Oh gosh, cow! No, I'm so sorry, Mr. Cow. But you had a key. I need to get you. Are you okay? You look fine. <laughs> We'll have to go all the way back up that again. I just need to get this key. There we go, excuse me. There we go, we got a new survival challenge. Maybe I can use him to get back up. Eh, sort of, kind of. But yeah, I can't wait to play the game. Apparently there is a beta of Dreams coming out later in 2018. If there is, I'll definitely be playing it. I've just had the questions like, hey, you're gonna be playing Dreams? Of course I'm gonna be playing Dreams. Can't wait for it, looks like a lot of fun. Oh gosh, oh gosh, there we go, we did it. <laughs> So let's go ahead and pick this up. You can tell why this place is called Boomtown. Oh, and we ran into a times two area over here. I'm probably, ow, not gonna be able to do this one on my own, but I'll definitely take a look. Hmm. I mean, most of this we'll tackle in the next episode. Oh, this looks cool though. Oh, it has some minecart action and everything. That looks like it could be really fun. But we'll check that out later. For right now, I can't worry about it too much. I think we're supposed to be using these bombs in some capacity, which will be Great, because the explosives in this game are just really tough to work with. Speaking of more explosives, if I jump off this stuff in the wrong way, I'm sure it'll go off. I don't know what it is, but the explosives in this one specifically are pretty finicky at times. Ooh, so I exploded a bunch of stuff, but over here you can see maybe, oh wait, that's more explosives. Okay, that's not what I was expecting. But there's more stuff too, I need to get it. Come on, excuse me, pardon me. I don't know if there's something I'm supposed to do to break this stuff, but for right now, I'll go like this and that should be good enough maybe. Oh, no, no, no. There has to be a way to explode this stuff. I'll try to figure it out soon. But, let me move this way for now. And grab, oh yeah, this button right here, duh. Oh, <laughs> that was great. Oh, right, that exploded all that stuff down that way. Cool. I don't know if that was supposed to be what happens there, but it's what happened. There's some tough secrets to start in this level onward that are, it's hard to get all the bubbles. You really have to figure it out. Well, I don't even know where I'm trying to go right now. I know I can go up here, right? Yep, okay. Oh, there are points? Oh, this is a big pinata. Yeah, of course there's points. Okay, we'll have to figure that out in just a second. But I can get up here. And there's a couple of things we can check out. With that big explosion we made. Whoa, 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 got it. Got it. So, I think that if I break that bubble on top of you. Oh, no, 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 wait. Ah, oh, darn it. Get back up here, got it. It's actually really tough to traverse because it really can be utterly random when things explode or how things explode. Oh, we got some new music, cool. So you just gotta be careful with how you explode things and try to traverse it as well as you can afterwards. And oh no, this guy got beat up. He's a, I think he's supposed to talk, but I think he's also like a bank robber. I don't know what happened there. That was a little ridiculous. Anyways, moving back this way. Excuse me, sir, I got places to be. I'm so sorry you're exploded. Try to get you a doctor. I'm all covered in soot as well, look at this. Can't even see my stripes anymore. <laughs> okay, well let's go down this way and just try to plop down forward because I do see this stuff hidden back this way. There is so much stuff to find in this level, it's insane. And that's not even including the times two area, so we got a lot of work cut out for us when it comes in the next episode. Really looking forward to it. But um, yeah, let's move this way and hmm. Oh, I do see this. There's something behind this ramp. Grab that. So what's the deal with this stuff? I don't really remember, but maybe I could just go into it from the side? No, because you can see that I, I was able to break this and all the stuff fell, but I can't really do that here. It's a bank full of different goodies, which is actually a really cool idea. I like it a lot. Oh, 
Ha ha! Talk about the talk about a boom town. Your precious jalapeno is in that cell. Being evil really rocks. Are you sure about that, sir? We're gonna make sure you get your you do justice. Oh, the rocket! Ooh, into the jail! Oh my gosh, this moves really fast. Don't squish me. Yeah, that's gonna be scary to use for the ace. I don't know if the ace will be that bad for this level. It's just sort of very luck based. Because, you know, if you die from one of the explosions, you gotta do it all over. We were able to get the rocket over this way. That was a cool little jump we made. Oh, and here's the jail. Whole bunch of little army men on top of it. Can I can I get you out of there? I guess not yet, but maybe I can break you out. No, here we go. Help me free Jalapeno. Go grab those explosions and push them over to the cell. X marks the spot. Will do. Oh gosh, we have creepy, oh yeah, we don't have creepy spiders. We have creepy scorpions and then spiders on the walls. I don't like this area. Keep moving. Okay, so yeah, oh, I do remember this being weird and very tough. So, no, wait, it's that guy who took my dog. No, he's taking the wedding people. They were on their honeymoon. Oh no. How a way to ruin the honeymoon. That thing didn't have anything to do with you. Jeez. Oh, hey, look, this is where we can do the little ducky. Yep, we got it right here. Is this right? It is, it's a little bit difficult. Oh, I remember this. If we, we gotta be careful because there's also that bomb switch trigger in the background. And if we place this ducky on the on the bomb, and then the whole thing explodes, we don't get our goodies. So we gotta be careful about that. But there we go, we got more music and stuff, so that's very cool. And moving back this way, I need to be very careful because if things touch this bomb the wrong way, it will explode. And that won't be very helpful, so. Just gotta move it. I gotta jump on top of it when I can! No, no, explode it! Come on, Mr. Scorpion, get out of here! Oh, gosh. No, 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 ah! <laughs> that was so rude! Jeez, come on. Okay, get back over there as fast as we can. And I'm gonna try to, it's, it's tough to angle this up just right! Oh, I don't like it. Oh, come on. Oh, oh come on, the jump didn't work! That's so cool, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 I'm not, I'm not ready. Come on, good work. Now stand clear over by the door and we'll get uncle out in no time at all. Okay. It's not what I wanted, but am I supposed to move it? Am I supposed to move out of the way? Oh, I'm supposed to wait on that X, right? Oh, there it goes. Oh, <laughs> well, there you go. Freedom, how can I thank you? I know, meet me down that hole and I'll show you how to use impact explosives. Huh, okay, well before we hop down that hole, let's make sure we pick up some of these dudes. We got little uh, toy cowboys, which I like. Very cool. Oh, and there we go, impact explosives. They'll explode on impact. Watch how they affect different materials and be careful when handling them. Use them to clear the tunnel on the right so we can escape. So I thought this was in the last level of this area, but it might be in this one as well. But there's some very difficult explosive stuff that makes this very, very, very hard to ace because sometimes just the natural way this works is not very helpful. Because they are, like, like I dropped it there, but I didn't drop it enough. It's very physics based, and because of that, there's sort of a point of randomness to it that is not easy to work with. We sort of had a sneak peek at these guys when we ran by that times two area. Okay, we need one more at the least. Oh, got it. Just gotta be careful it doesn't hit the walls too much or we're gonna go kaput. Boom, no, we need another one. <laughs> Gosh darn it, it's not easy. But luckily it doesn't really chip away at the rock, it only chips away at the stuff it's supposed to chip away at. And drop, boom, nice stuff. So we get another jetpack. There's a times two area this way, blocked off by sponge for some reason. And I guess the idea is that I can grab one of, ow, come on, that was silly. Grab one of these. Oh yeah, this that gets really tough. I remember that. Thought that was in the last level of this area. You can just break through the sponge, and there's a number of times two stuff going on here. I don't think I've ever done this one, so that'll be interesting to try out. I think I'm definitely gonna need some help when it comes to the times two areas of this this you know whole story mission. Okay, so I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. Oh gosh, not that way. Not that way. Throw it that way. Come on, push it. Perfect. Was that enough to get me through? Oh, not quite at all. Jeez, that is tough. So let's keep trying this. I definitely wanna use the jetpack where I can. So if that's here. Ooh, okay. And, oh, come on, that was not very good. Uh, uh, 
I don't think it would hurt if these things are a little bit more separated because that happens. And it's just like, you gotta move quickly between them or it's gonna come down and hurt you. But if you move too fast, it's gonna swing, hit the other one and explode. It's just like, oh, come on. That's just silly. Whoop, that was bad. <laughs> I gotta try to find a way to just like place it down gently without it exploding. I don't know if that's gonna happen or not. But it's what we gotta try. Oh, come on. That was baloney. No, we're gonna let, no, that was b double baloney. What the heck, I gotta do the whole thing over now. Well, at least I was able to get a new material, finally made that jump. Ah, I can't believe it. <laughs> there we go, finally got it. So we're out of there. We got ourselves a sombrero object, awesome. Plenty fine reward. Well done, quick grab onto the guard. Let's go find Zapata before he gets away. All right, we'll give it our best shot. So it looks like we made it. It was not easy. Honestly, that may be the most difficult level. I mean, we're not quite done, as you can see. We still have more stuff to go. We're riding this minecart, woo! <laughs> Much easier than the Donkey Kong games. And there we go, we made it to the end. It was a lot of hard work, but we were able to get it done, which wins us a fringe dress and red flower skin. Very cool, so we got a good 75% of the items collected, not bad, so we just gotta find that remaining 25%, which might be a bit of a challenge, and the ace will definitely be very challenging. But hey, we don't have to worry about that now. All we gotta worry about is moving on to the next level. Okay, so here we are back at the world, or the earth, and as you can see, we got the mines unlocked, which is Zabata thinks he can hide in the mines. Prove him wrong. So Zapata is the bad guy, but the guy we're helping was the guy in the jail. It is sort of weird, but hey, whatever we can do to help. That's what we're here for. So this level I remember is really fun. I don't remember it being all that difficult, so we'll find out together. See maybe I'm, if I'm wrong or not, but just gotta wait for it to load. Whenever that'll be. Oh, here we go, we're moving. Whoa, Zapata is, has headed into the mines after him. All right, let's give it a shot. Oh, we got these guys. Gotta bounce off of their heads, make sure they're not causing me too much of a problem. As always, we'll try to survive for long enough that we can get an ace, even if the chances seem low. And I've already messed this up. Uh, well, I missed out on some stuff there. <laughs> I don't know. Should I try to die to get the stuff, or should I try to get the ace now? It'd probably be smarter just to try to get the ace now. Oh gosh, I missed out on that. Oh, here comes another one. There's a lot of mine carts, of course. This is the mine, after all. Go, 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 go. Whoa, we're moving. Wow, we're really moving. Oh, I could have been squished there. I just got lucky. <laughs> Just got lucky. Boing. Oh no, no, come on. No, I was trying to do the combo jump. That's lame. Oh well, we tried. Didn't turn out so well. That's okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Be careful. And you know what? I don't know if there's anything hiding in there. I suppose not. Huh, interesting. So these ones, as you can see, what I gotta do is lower the drawbridge. I don't know why it says, oh, I do see that up there. See that? I guess that's why it's times two. Somebody has to launch me up there. I mean, that might be something I can do on my own. It might be a little bit of a challenge, but we can try it. Okay, moving on over this way. Whoa, 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 come back, come back, come back. Or not, oh, okay. Well, oh, hey, like I dropped something on my head. I guess, yeah, I could have accidentally dropped that into the, the fire up there. Glad I didn't do that. Or fire down here, I mean. Okay, let's try to get that thing right there. The quench. I guess I quench your thirst is some kind of drink. Whoa. Whoa, 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 Hold on, let's get this checkpoint and then I'm gonna move back down this way. Cause I'm not done with this. There's clearly something to the left. And those guys jumping up and down aren't so easy to deal with. I love how these enemies to the left, the guys I died to, their, their movement is just two little legs pitter-pattering over and over again. Do we have this? We do not. Oh, well. Hopefully we can get it soon. But for now, let me jump back over to this thing, this little what, what would this even be called? Like a can, it's not a conveyor belt. Something like that, I don't know. We'll just, this is a conveyor belt right here. Okay, so we just gotta be careful of this guy because he just jumps around like a lunatic. Same thing with this dude. Whoop, there we go. So, whoa, we're being launched. Oh, I got it all. Usually that takes me a few jumps to, to get it right. Not this time, awesome. So I guess I was exploding enough stuff so that I can go over this way. Oh gosh, no, 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 no. Oh, I wanted to get that other thing. Not doing a very good job at that at the moment. Hmm. Okay, so what do we got going on with this stuff? Ooh, gotta grab it. And we're holding on tight, let's go, jump for it. Oh boy, you can hold on to the handles though, which is nice. Whoa, you told her to lose her head. Wowee, that is so crazy fast, I love it. 
Okay, let's go down this way and see what we can do. It looks like we're going to the mines below. I don't think this is very safe for anybody, but especially not me. <laughs> I'm just happy that we fit. I don't know how Zapata fit through this, you know? I mean, maybe he found a different way. Usually is the case. Here goes jump. Yeah, so far, pretty good. Whoa, whoa, he has a little mallet. I didn't even see that before I jumped. That could have been really nasty. Okay, so yeah, I think I remember this. Oh yeah, these are timed bombs. So when the two points of the arrows meet, that bomb should explode. So we wanna to try to match things up as much as possible. This is actually quite a tough race to do because you do have to explode things multiple times. I think that if we, can we bring two bombs in at once? Yeah, we can, oh wow, the more you know. Okay, well that'll actually be helpful if we double these things up. It should get through there faster, perfect. And then we'll jump, grab that, and keep moving. I don't think we need those bombs for any of this, so let's keep moving. Oh, we do need a bomb here, don't we? No, 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 that just explodes it. Whoa, look at the cool flip it does. I like that. Okay, moving up this way. I need to find a way in there. Probably just by jumping like that, gotcha. I don't know what that is, it's like an apple. That one's gonna be fine. Oh, the point points are going down. Oh, the end of the race is right here, but then I can't go this way and figure out what this is. So I'm really curious. Okay, um, what? Yeah, that worked, okay, cool. Oh, get all these points so I can save on time. Make up for some of it. Okay, so moving back this way. Quickly end the race before the time runs out, and boom, keep moving. Oh, we got some more minecart action. Let's figure out what we're doing here. Oh boy, can jump for some points if I wanted to. Don't know how good of an idea that is. Whoa, whoa, watch out for those guys too. Okay, we're doing pretty good with the points. Oh, jump for this, get the key. Yeah, key, awesome. So let's keep moving and got it, got it, got it, no, ow, oof, oh, that was bad. Just trying to get what I could there, it didn't turn out so well. Probably just wanna focus on the actual prize bubbles and not the, the points, because the points aren't that helpful. But we'll see what we can do. I think actually, oh, what, what, what happened there? <laughs> Never mind, okay. Oh, I think I actually had the highest score out of all my accounts for this level so far, which is crazy to think about. I didn't even do that well. So I don't know what's going on there. And we're not even done with the level. If I jump at the right times, I could get quite a lot more points, but not gonna worry about it. I'm just gonna worry about the extra stuff. But I really want them, I'm so greedy. So there's something coming up as soon as we start speeding up here. And the speed up is where it gets tough because it's really easy to lose momentum. With the car, there's a bit of a traffic jam. <laughs> That's not so helpful. Oh, we got this mallet swinging dude. Let's swing one more time. Boing. Got it. So we got more of these spinny things. I don't know what's down below. I mean, I guess I could hold on tight and find out, but I just want this for right now. Oh, I think it's more of the spinny things. What do you know? How topical. So it looks like there's nothing below these. Look at my little feet running. I'm getting out of here. There we go. Whoop. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, that stinks. Got to do it all over again. Oh, there is definitely something at the bottom of this one. But this is probably not the most productive way to do this. But it's the way I'm determined to do it now that I've started. Oh, it's a little mallet guy. Well, we've got that. And this way, got it, awesome, jump. And go for it, whoa, whoa, -ho -ho, we did it, awesome. So what is going on with all this? It looks like we have a little button to press. Whoop. And here it comes. Is this the last mine cart? I think we're coming up on the last mine cart. Oh gosh, well, we're moving. We got some real speed this time. Oh, we gotta jump for it. Whoa, -ho -ho -ho, that is so cool. We actually unlocked the mine cart there too. Very nice. Whoa, what's happening? Whoa, that is cutting it very close. And no, 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 get out of the mine cart quick. Whoa, that was, that was, I don't know how to feel about that. That could have gone really nasty. What is going on up here? Oh, this is uh, something. I do not have this either. There's two sticker things I've missed out on so far. Moving this way, it's a whole times two area that I don't think we're gonna be able to handle. Ooh, actually I like the idea of it so far. Looks pretty cool. But we'll have to leave that for some other time. Let's plop down this way. I'm trying to figure this out. Okay, so I see this over this way. Try to grab that like this, yeah. Hmm, and I see all this stuff, whoa, okay. There's another key, we already got one key. Here's a second one, and I think some music too. Whoa, 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 ah, oh, 
Darn it. We were doing so well, too. Let's try that again. I can also keep an eye out for anything I may have missed. But I don't think there is actually too much, because we pop down here and we're done. Got it. Okay. Jump off the east. Yo, come on! The jump messed up. I got, I, I got taken out on the easy part. That's lame. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't get our butt burned by that. Keep moving. Good job. And, ooh, I don't trust this. I don't trust this. Got it, and got it. Oh, I could have tried for a triple jump, but I didn't want to. <laughs> I've died enough times as it is. What is this about? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Giant Indiana Jones boulder chasing after us. I actually don't know if it's possible to outspeed this thing. I swear it isn't. I don't think I've ever outsped that thing. It moves so fast. I mean, I guess I've had to at some point because it keeps respawning, right? Oh, here it comes, here it comes. It's so quick, though. I mean, I guess you're only supposed to get down here, right? Like, it slows down a lot, that first little, or the big, yeah, the first big gap. There we go. Now we got some good speed on it. Ow, just don't burn our bum or it might catch up. We need to do little jumps to keep our momentum. Yeah, we made it! Awesome! And here you are. Hey, wow, you've, you've found the entrance to the Ancient Serpent Shrines. A pattern must be in there. All right, let's go and find out together, my friend. Can I grab you, by the way? Can I just like bring you around? I can't, you look so angry though. Oh well. Okay, well, we, we did it. We survived the mines, quote unquote, survive. But hey, we got the pigtails hair wig and the brown camo, two items that obviously go together. And we got 47, yeesh, that's a low score for us. Oh uh, well, hopefully we'll be able to do a little bit better next time. I think we got the best score we've ever gotten in this level, which is weird, because I didn't do so well. But yeah, I did pretty good. Nice. Okay, so the next level we have is the Serpent Shrine by Uncle Jalapeno, and if we take a look at the description, make your way through the ancient shrine to find and defeat Zapata. Let's go. Hopefully this turns out okay. <laughs> but yeah, this is the final level of the, what's it called? The, not the canyons, it's something. Oh, uh, whatever. <laughs> but it's the final level of this area. Beware the fiery serpent. Save yourself for your confrontation with Sheriff Zapata. All right, we'll do what we can. Gotta create a staircase here to get up. Oh yeah, I remember this. With all of the super fast snakes that are hard to dodge, it gets stressful. But hey, it'll be worth checking out. Oh gosh, we got these little spiky guys already. So I think there's like more than one way you can sort of kind of go around to. You could go down below. I don't know if it's all that helpful, but I think you can do it. There we go. Oh, we gotta go quick before that hits me. I don't know if it's worth going down that way. I'm gonna assume now. But I gotta be careful, because there could be stuff to find everywhere. There we go, we got it. Oh, I remember those snake guys up here too. These guys are a major pain, because ow, that happens. They're very big, so they take up a lot of space. Oh, oh, okay. Well, that's not what I want. This is not what I wanted. Get me out of here. Oh, that's creepy. Whoa! Silver jump! Hey, I landed on one of them, too. You're supposed to take them out and they'll hide a prize inside, but they're so big, it can be hard to work with them. They're, they're weird, that's for sure. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Watch it, buddy. I have boundaries. I'm sure you do, too, so watch it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Got it again. Okay, so... This is where things get a little weird, because I'm pretty sure there's something down there. I might end up snagging this checkpoint, moving back this way and trying to find out together. I swear there was something down here, but I guess not. I'm wrong. Okay, well, we have to go this way. No, gosh! Oh, this dude's gonna be a pain. Boop, boop, boop! <laughs> guess he wasn't that much of a pain. All right, are we ready? Jump! This level is very cool. It's just very, I guess, it's whimsical and foreign in a way. Oh, hey, another trigger, and we actually have this one, right? Yeah, nice, okay, so that gave us a couple of things there. New decoration, new stickers, all sorts of stuff. Pretty nice. Boing. Okay. And let's get these points too, because why not? Already doing pretty good on our score, I think. Wanna keep it that way, though. So it's gonna keep going. Is this a times two area? We need a little salamander to get stuff here. Unfortunately, I don't have that. Pretty sure this is like a times two thing. Maybe I'm wrong, though. Boing. I mean, it doesn't say times two anywhere, so I guess not. Oh yeah, I think for this guy, I need to jump off him at just the right time to grab that. Ain't that big of a deal, though. Most of the enemies aren't that bad to get, 
Honestly, a lot of this game's difficulty comes from being able to work with the physics. If you can work with the physics and get rid of all the, the guys without messing up your jumps, which is a very easy thing to do, it, you should be fine. It's just easy to mess that up. Or the snake slithering through, which has gotta be careful. Oh boy, very scary. Whoop, got it. Now this is a time two area over this way. Hmm. Let me take a look at this one. Get a little bit of a lay of the land. Chances are, I won't be able to do much of it. But hey, I should just take a look and find out. Yeah, this is the times two section. So all that was just getting here. Very odd. Yeah, I see it. So we'd have to hold them up, and then hold them up again, and then they'd have to get over there and collect all this stuff. Gotcha. Okay, well, I'll try to figure that one out. Let's plop down this way, and get back to work with this. We. Okay, what is this? Oh, we can push this block, get up in here. This is, I think, some extra stuff, right? Ooh, do we have this? I don't think we do. Oh, uh, we only have this thing. Lots of switch triggers so far in this area, which I think is pretty cool. Okay, let's wait for the snake one more time. Or not, never mind. Okay, he just like wasn't showing up. Oh yeah, and then there's also like the coals falling down. Hey, get back here! I need you! There it is. Oh, let's get you out of here so I can grab this thing. Move back this way, Mr. Snake Python thing. Get out of here. He's got some big googly eyes. Wait, 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 I missed out on the prize. Gotta go back, gotta go back. Yeah, awesome. Okay, dodge that stuff. Move away from this. Ooh. Okay, we're doing good. Get through here. Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. I jumped there, game. Don't know what your dealio is. That's sort of the problem, is that sometimes I feel like I jump, but the game disagrees. Doing that double jump though got us up here, got us a new sticker, which is pretty cool. Whoa, 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 be careful. Be careful. Got it. Okay, so we gotta grab on tight to this and I'll go back up before the snake gets here. That's good, keep moving, keep moving. Try that again. Thank you. Hi, hi, hi. And we're just gonna wait here for now. Nice and safe. Okay, let's move quickly before that snake shows back up. I'm scared. Ah, no! Wait, hold on. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. It was very close. Keep moving, keep moving. Oh, that's gonna be a cool photo. Oh, I do see Zapata up there. How do I get up to that? I am not sure. Maybe Zapata can tell me. So you made it here, eh? No matter, I'll get you with my timed explosives. <laughs> yeah, it's quite an interesting laugh. Uh, let's go ahead and grab that Zapata. And, whoa, and there you go. See ya. Oh, I remember, this is like a proper boss fight. <laughs> it's pretty cool. So we need to grab this, ow, that's not what we do. What do, oh, the timed explosives, gotcha. So we just bring this over this way, set it up like that, and then continue to dodge things. Yeah, we gotta do it again though. So after he throws three normal bombs, explosives, he's going to throw a timed one. Whenever that makes its little buzzer noise, that means it's about to go off, so you gotta be real careful of that. There we go, that's perfect actually. Come on, whoa, we're all covered in soot. Oh, we're okay. Oh, there's another one. Oh, I remember this being super tough. I do remember this. Hopefully the timer for this one's a little bit slower because it's super duper easy to accidentally get something stuck. Now it's gonna explode, it's gonna explode. How much I can do about this one. Oh, there's another one. Oh, I caught it before it rolled way off that way. Here's the problem though. We gotta go over here real fast. Oh, I did pretty good with that one. I remember dying a lot uh, to this section, just like that. I feel like this is one of the tougher areas to have limited lives on, just because of how it works, you know? Okay, go now. I don't know if we're gonna be able to make this. I don't know, we're gonna try it though. We're gonna try it, we're gonna try it. Whoa, it exploded me, but it exploded that too. Okay, we got this one as well. I'm gonna go through that same pattern and we should be able to do it in record time. That's good, that's good. I just gotta make sure I don't die. Just gotta make sure I gotta hide under here. C is a part of that's gonna send you sky high. Oh, there's this arm, yeesh. Okay, that was a little bit more gruesome than I thought it would be. I mean, he was a bad guy, but man, I need a vacation. Let's drive to the Metropolis and visit my good friend, Mags the Mechanic, who can show you her cars. That sounds like fun, let's go. This car doesn't drive. I guess we have to wait here. Very cool, level completes as Zapata is defeated. And we were able to save our little friend too. And we got a frying pan to end the canyons. Oh, the frying pan is fun. You can actually equip that and hit people with it. 
<laughs> and there we go, the, can the canyons, that's what it was called. I thought it was called something else, but I was wrong. But yeah, 70, was it 76%? Not that bad, we'll get the remaining 24% in the next episode. It'll be a lot of hard work next episode, but it'll be well worth it and a lot of fun. So there we go, we have completed the canyons for the first time around, being able to contribute whatever we could. We got lots more mini games and stuff to play, and then the episode after that, we'll be going to the Metropolis. But for now, I think that's just about going to wrap it up for today's episode of Little Big Planet. Before we're done, I do need to get something in this pod. So let's try to find out what we want to do this time. I wish I had more options, to be honest with you, but I mean, we have tons of different colors. I could maybe put down a landscape of some sort to help us remind us of our adventure. I could do the E Calavera. Or no, that's not E, that's a caliber with a exclamation point. Okay, gotcha. Never mind. Thought it was an I. Uh we could do a piano, that'd be pretty cool. Lots of cool decorative stuff. Little doodles. Oh, we could make a ghost with a face. Oh, that'd be so cool. Uh, I don't want to do it there. I wanna do it over this way. Maybe not, maybe somewhere down this way. I don't know, I'm trying to figure this out right now. Maybe just on the floor. There's so many different places, but it can be a little hard to figure out. There we go. And then we gotta do like funny face on him. Funny face for sure. But not the same funny face we did before. We gotta do a different funny face. So we got all these different, oh, uh, we could do these lips. Oh, it's tough to do it when he's down here. You know what? I might actually end up putting him somewhere else. I mean, I, I have him there for now. But I think up here on the wall would be a little bit easier to just sort of do. <laughs> I like how that guy's still in the ceiling looking down on us like, I believe in you, Zebra. You will win this adventure sooner or later. So let's do this mouth. And that's a fun one. He's gonna be a happy, fun time ghost. There we go, and then just two eyeballs. We will do, oh, there's so many options. We could do the real life eyeballs, but that's sort of creepy. Maybe we'll just do these. That'll be fine. Got it, and got it. Excellent, so we got a happy little ghost in the corner of our pod. I'll have to clean up this other one real fast because it's just chilling out here and taking up space. I don't like that. So let's try to find where the colors at. So I know we have blank colors somewhere right here, so we just need this black square, get one of every color, which is pretty cool. Just cover this up real fast, <laughs> like it never even happened. Excellent, so that's gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Little Big Planet. If you watched this for the video, make sure you comment explosive zebra, so now you've watched at the end of the URA Zebra Task Viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing and doing the zebra heart. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye bye.